We're experiencing some really interesting energy right now, and I don't remember anything like this coming in for a long, long time. Usually when we get these energetic waves, they trigger a lot of fear, a lot of anxiety, a lot of stress. The emotional baggage, this one seems to be focused more on the physical upgrades, and it's like it just kind of slid right in under the mental body, under the emotional body, landed in the physical body, and it's doing its work going deep within the cells, it's activating DNA, and it is removing anything that no longer serves the body. This is allowing your body to rise in frequency. And as the body rises in frequency, it becomes a vessel for higher frequency light. So you're going to be experiencing more downloads, more energy, more motivation, right? As this energy moves through your lower chakras, you're going to feel more empowered, more worthy, more confident. That's exactly what's been happening to me recently. The other night, I reached out to my Arcturian guides, had some a little bit of heaviness and some weird symptoms happening and things like that. Asked for healing, received the healing, woke up with a purge, feeling it in my upper chakras, my crown chakra, my third eye, even a little bit in my throat, a lot of energy moving through there, some physical symptoms, right? Some stuffiness, some congestion. All of these things are releasing for a while, for months, I had a lot of pressure in my sinuses, it felt like over on this side. It's all starting to release. Thank you to the Arcturians for the healing that I was given or blessed with the other night. Now I'm working through that release and allowing myself to stay centered and just moving that energy through me. But it's coming with a whole lot more motivation, a whole lot more energy, um, a brighter outlook um, more joy and even more peace. I know usually when we have these big energetic waves come in, solar storms and things, it triggers a lot of the emotional baggage. Again, this energy is really interesting as it's kind of like sliding in beneath that, getting deep into the cells and allowing this massive just change within the physical body. As this happens, the body will rise in frequency and you will feel less attached to the dense identities, to the dense emotions. So it's important though, to stay connected with your body because when we get these types of upgrades, it, it's expansive on our field, right? It just pushes everything out here. We wanna get back into the body. So make sure you take time throughout your day to ground, stay hydrated, breathe, breathe into the lower chakras. It's generally where the energy gets stuck, breathe in there to get it flowing so it moves up your channel and your heart and up here, it moves all the stuff that is freeing up in the upper chakras. Let's get that energy moving through the central channel. If you can get outside in nature, just experience the earth's energy. That's another great thing to do. But most importantly, if you're being called to sit with this, sit with it and feel it. If you're being called to dance, to move, to go for a jog, to work out, whatever, do that. Whatever your intuition is guiding you to do. Sometimes your body needs to sit to recover. Other times it needs to move to keep the energy moving through it. That right there is a healing process in and of itself. So do what you're being called to do. You're gonna have periods of peace and joy and tranquility with this energy. It's the underlying stuff now coming up. The space has been created. If you're anchored in your body and you've dropped in below the emotions, you're gonna, you know, the dense emotions, you're gonna start to feel some of that stillness, some of that peace, some of that joy, that is a connected body. That is your body that is rising in frequency, connected and attracting more of your higher self, more of your light, more of your multidimensional energy. It is available to you. Feel it, breathe with it, build the circuitry, expand it, expand it into your heart as you breathe, expand it into your solar plexus, your sacral, your root. Get it in there and breathe with it and feel it. Because when you can embody these elevated emotional states, they become who you are. And when you do get triggered and some density comes up, say anxiety or fear, more of you, your higher self is gonna be available to alchemize that energy. You're gonna have a circuitry built because you felt it and embodied it, right? When you experienced it, it's gonna become available to you when you're triggered, when the heavy stuff comes up. And that allows you to transmute it so much more effortlessly. So the new you is dropping in as we speak. The body is going through all of these changes. Honor the process. I'm so grateful for the process, even though I feel a little 
stuffy. I feel a little congested. When I drop in, I can really feel the, the energy, the restored motivation, the restored excitement, and most of all, just the peace, the tranquility, and the joy for just being here, being able to experience this process, okay? If you are looking to embody the new you and embody your higher self, I'm offering free calls for my program. Drop me a comment telling me you're ready. Say, I'm ready, and I'll send you the link for that or send me an email through my website. I'll get you a link for free discovery call with me. If this video resonated with you, watch this one next. I'd be so grateful. Thank you.